Today we're gonna make our snowman. The first thing we're gonna do is practice our cutting skills. So remember your thumb goes in a smaller hole and your fingers go in the other, how many, ever many you can fit. And remember we chomp away from ourselves like it's an alligator chomping. So I have my snowman head and body. So this is just like a school picture of a snowman. So it's just the shoulders and the head. So we're gonna practice our cutting skills. The goal is to cut on that black line the best we can, or the alligator is chomping the paper. When I get here, I turn the paper. That's kind of hard to do. I'm gonna teach you another way you can do that too when we get around. But you can just turn the paper. I usually keep the scissors going straight and turn the paper as I go. I know this takes a while, but we'll get there. Now, another thing, if you have trouble turning corners, I can stop here and then I can flip my paper over and start here and cut in. And that way, when I get to that center part, it just cuts right off and that's my scrap. So this is my snowman. I'm gonna set my scissors aside for now. And you can pick any color you want for your background color. I just grabbed a blue, but it could be purple, green. I would say anything but white would be fine. And we wanna have this, again, like a school picture. So we want this at the bottom of the paper. Now, which paper do I put the glue on? Do I put it on the blue or the white? The correct answer is the white. You always put the glue on the smaller piece of paper. Because if I put it on the blue, I don't know exactly where to put it. So I'm gonna take my glue stick and I'm gonna add glue on the edges. I like this glue that has the purple so I can see where I go. Put quite a bit of it. You don't need to put it in the middle. If you want to put it in the middle, just put it next, but I think it's fine without. Then I'm gonna close the glue so it doesn't dry out. I'm gonna flip it over and then, is it gonna stick without me pressing down? Not so well, look at it curling up. So I'm gonna press it down and we're gonna count to 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, see if it stays. Yes. Now, this is where, this is called mixed media, which means we're gonna use a lot of different materials to create our snowman. So we can look and see like, oh, let me see. I wanna do a scarf. So I have some ribbon here. So I could take and I could make a scarf. That would be kind of cool. So I could put my glue stick on here and then I could glue it like that. I could, let me see, I could take markers if I wanted to and I could make the face if, maybe I want to give him green eyes to match the green scarf. So I could make some eyes. Could do that, whatever you want. Maybe mine has little eyelashes coming up. You can be as creative as you want. You can also use construction paper scraps. So I can take this orange scrap for his nose and I can take and make, you can see, I cut a triangle out earlier. I'm gonna cut a triangle out of the orange. Then, how do I get it to stick out? Oh, I'll teach you a technique. You can take and, hold on, I don't like the shape of mine. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna take one of the ends and I'm gonna bend it just a little bit. And then I could put some glue right here. I'm gonna grab my glue stick again. I always put the lid back on so it doesn't dry out though. Yeah, just set right there. And then I'm gonna press it here and we can have that stick out like that. I could also take construction paper, make a hat of some sort, or I could use my markers, whatever you would like to do. And then I could take some yarn and it doesn't have to be realistic colors. Maybe I want some green and pink hair and maybe I add just a little bit at the top and I could put maybe the hat up there. I could put some buttons down here if I wanted to. You are being as creative as you can. Maybe I even take, let me see if I have, I don't have a brown, so why not purple arms? Maybe I wanna make the little sticks that come up. This is where you are just creative and you decide what you want to do. And that is perfectly fine with me. So have fun.